Communications, networking, and space isn't science fiction. It's critical infrastructure for the emerging space economy. With the help of a Lockheed Martin satellite, Filecoin Foundation recently completed a successful mission to demonstrate what the future of space communications could look like. The mission involved sending files back and forth from space using IPFS, the Interplanetary File System. IPFS is a decentralized network that could significantly speed up communications in space compared to today's centralized internet model. With today's centralized internet model, data is retrieved from a particular server in a particular place. Let's say you're on Mars. Each time you retrieve data from Earth, there will be a multi-minute delay as the data goes from Earth to Mars. But with IPFS, data doesn't need to go back and forth from Earth with every click. That's because with IPFS, data is identified by what it is rather than where it is. Each piece of content has a unique content ID. When you look for a piece of content with IPFS, that content is retrieved from wherever is closest, rather than being retrieved from a particular place. That means if a device nearby has already retrieved that data, it can get to you quickly instead of traveling back and forth from Earth. There are other benefits to using IPFS in space. One challenge with storing data in space is that the data can easily be corrupted by radiation, or the storage hardware can be damaged by debris. With IPFS, you can store many copies of data in many different locations. If there are many copies of the data, it doesn't matter if some of those copies have been lost or corrupted. IPFS content IDs also mean that you can cryptographically verify that data hasn't been tampered with. If a piece of content is altered, its content ID will be different as a result. That means you can prove the authenticity of data from space, like satellite images. Filecoin Foundation's successful mission to put IPFS in space demonstrates how IPFS can enable the future of space communications.